ladies, gents, welcome to another vlog, e-vlog. It's gonna be one of those vlogs that are also uh, e-vlog, you know, vlog, e-vlog. There we go. I'm leaving Dirty Billy, the dirtiest of Billies. This awesome little shop in Brooklyn, New York. This community garage that I frequent and I love. Um, is there Popo up ahead? This thing is telling me there's Popo. I don't believe it though. Um, nobody gets upset. It's gonna be fine. Traffic is thick. So yeah, Dirty Billy, I just changed my tire. I just put on a new rear tire. A whole new, uh... Is there really like an issue of some sort? Good Lord, bro. Sorry guys, I need to figure out this before I get... Amaturity. And my tire is brand new, so I cannot go spicy. Um, yeah, Dirty Billy, it's my spot. Just put on a new rear tire. My front was fine. Oh, oh. Didn't really uh, check the tire pressure. I'm such a dummy. Let me double check. I think it's fine. Yeah. I checked it last night, but now that I think about it, I should have fucking checked it this morning because I did it last night. But I'm gonna be all right. Silly me, silly wabbit. Look at this, yoink, yoinkers. What is this vlog about? This one is one of those rare ones that has no motive. As you guys know, most of my vlogs are deep epics strong morals i'm always teaching you about just like life and how to be you know look at that truck that truck is being nice thank you but at what point is he gonna stop being nice starting getting real i mean look how awesome these apartments will be with the with the circular windows there It'll be a lot of sun this dude decides to go at the last second all right. Look at this fucking lady. This lady doesn't give a fuck. She's in the Tucson. See what I mean? People say bikers give people a bad name, right? At least a biker's tiny. Look at, look at this lady. As per norm, yeah. Left my bike a dirty belly because I had a few beers. I have a rule where, like, one beer, sure. If I have to, I'll ride after one beer. Two beers, if I wait some time, you know, then sure, maybe I'll ride after a little bit of time. Three beers, I'm starting to get sloppy, and no riding of any sort will happen, even after a period of time. That's why I kind of don't put myself in a position where I drink a bunch of beer and then have to ride home. You should stay the night or have different transportation. So that's why I left at a dirty belly for the night. But yeah, you guys should definitely hit them up if you're in New York City. It makes sense. I mean, $240 a month, you get tools, lifts, everything. There's no way you're gonna find like a garage for that cheap. If you just look privately or whatever, it's impossible. Ooh, a little bit of speed, just for a second. Inevitably, the traffic comes back up. But for now, I'm just chilling. Beautiful.
no caminho. Probably should not be running it on a brand new tire. Who knows what the grip is like? Let's just relax. Plus it's cold. You know what I mean? It's literally cold. Chilly. Absolutely no reason to uh be a vicious boy. Made up one minute from all that. Look at this G class, little AMG. Mm. Tasty. buckets another beautiful weekend well actually no it's gonna be warm but it's not gonna be beautiful it's gonna be rainy but right today it's gonna be 60 plus freaking mid mid november and it's 80 plus i mean 80 plus 60 plus how is that possible you glass fine we're totally fine everybody's okay this person's from jersey so they're like a little bit unsure about what to do it's gonna be fine Look at that little balcony. I'd love to chill right there. I mean, it's BQE. During the day, it's probably a little weird. I'd still do it. But at night, all the cars flying by, probably a little bit loud and noisy, but awesome nonetheless. And you got this downtown. Look at this beautiful building they're building downtown Brooklyn. The weird, tall skyscraper situation. You probably pass all these people. And I will, but I'm also trying to be like just a gentle boy, you know? There's Wegmans. Look at these people. Fucking smokers. Go on the shoulder if you're gonna go around them. Are you people freaking stupid? Yo, that person is sh pure dummy. Idiots. That's why motorcycles are the best. By far. The best mode of transportation. Because look at this person. Immaturity impersonified. impersonified. my new way I used to go on the other way for so long but then there's so much construction in Dumbo there was one time where they just stopped traffic for like fucking 10 minutes while God knows what happened um, so I was like you know what no more look at this it's pretty intense we're behind trucks and whatnot downtown Brooklyn See that building right there? The one that's, uh, I don't want to start waving my arms around, but the one right there, the one to the right, the tall one to the right, not the left. I was going to live there. And I'm so happy I fucking didn't, because look at it, no balconies, weird area. Nah, bro, are you fucking going or not? Strange motherfucker.
long day ahead today too. And of course, the most important meeting of all happens at 3.30. Like, who are these people who, uh, I don't know, people busier than me, I guess. I'm like, yo, if we're gonna have a super important meeting, like super important meeting, why would you have it at 3.30 when everybody's tired and everybody's been at it for like seven hours? I mean, there's nothing wrong, like, if it has to be at 10 p.m. or whatever, then so be it, but I know for a fact we could have had it earlier. Whatever, it's fine. Some people don't even start their day till like 10.30, you know? Some people don't show up to the office or don't start working till like 10.30. I don't know how that's possible because at that point half the day is fucking gone. Look at this person. They got no rush. They got a range, bro. The fuck? The fuck they gotta rush for, bro. I think they're taking the left or going straight. You're not gonna fucking go through? What is this shit? usually here behind buses and whatnot. This is a new territory. I always wonder why people in Range Rovers oftentimes are so, well, you know, probably not their car. Bro, what the fuck are you doing? Fucking dickhead. You are a freaking stupid cow. After all that. Sorry. <laughs> Not necessary to go in that hard. I knew that person was going to be a... Uh, Slow Bike feels better with the proper tire, without a doubt. Oh, I'm trying to decide if I'm gonna leave the office at noon today to take care of something or if I'm gonna just. Who knows? How active do I wanna be today? You know, that's the question. On a scale of 1 to 10. How active am I trying to be? Look at this, the street is fucked. They really gotta repair it. Parking spot there. Parking spot right here. Right here, right here. finally move those pieces of shit. Alright. That's fair. That's fair. Let's go around the block then. Yeah, kid. Banana. It's fine. Quick little loop, don't hurt no one. Gotta make sure there's no uh, coppers. Then I'll be able to just pull up right here. Park up. Beautiful. And you know this person is gonna take care of their car when they pull out. That's a beautiful Benz. There we go. Got this 
baby in. Back this baby in. Now I just gotta look back, make sure my rear tire is still inflated. Yep. Good. Hi, right, boys and girls. I'll talk to you later.